Russia may attack another European country. President Volodymyr Zelensky is convinced that Russia will continue to spread lies regarding Transnistria, unrecognized breakaway state that is internationally recognized as a part of Moldova and does not rule out that Putin may attack another European country. Zelensky said, unfortunately, yes, I believe that Russia's attack on another country is possible and it may happen. I can explain why. President Putin has to be presented with gains and victories. There will be no advances on the battlefield in Ukraine. There will be no massive comeback. At the very least, we will fight. And if there is a supply of weapons, we will be stronger. Therefore, Putin will have to be presented with gains. And everyone understands that it may be where there is a weakness and preferably in those states where Moscow had had influence in Soviet times and also where there are certain problems, certain conflicts, certain separate institutions. This is what is happening. And this is Moldova. You you know the example of Moldova. Zelensky recalled that Ukrainian intelligence had intercepted the Kremlin's plans to take control of Moldova, which he immediately reported to his Moldovan counterpart, Maya Sandu and the EU. Zelensky states that Russia wanted to change the leadership of Moldova despite the fact that the aggressor country does not border his country and therefore there could only be a landing possibility, one such that could have taken place, for example, in Transnistria. The the president also added that Russia continues to prepare lies to destabilize the situation. In particular, after the intelligence interception, it took Russia only two weeks to launch another information attack. Now they are throwing in information regarding the situation on the border, on the contact line between Transnistria and Ukraine, that there are some misunderstandings and shots fired. And they are pushing this information through the media that Ukraine is going to enter the territory of Transnistria. Why are they doing this. They clearly understand that we respect the territorial integrity of Moldova and we believe that the territory of Transnistria is the territory of the independent state of Moldova and the Russians are constantly making provocations. From the very beginning of the war there were shots fired in our direction from the territory of Transnistria. They wanted us to come in and I said that Moldova should think about this and think about how to solve this issue. Russia acted from different sides. I believe that Russia will try to make some progress and they will persistently take such steps.